Right, yes, hello you crazy cats. I am back. Unfortunately, there will not be a pack opening today. <clears throat> this is more of um, explaining my position and what is going on for the channel in the future. So, lockdown hit me incredibly hard, both mentally and sort of on money. Um, so, I haven't been able to buy any more packs. Everything I have been opening on the channel. I was buying week by week, and I was actually buying on finance, which was an incredibly stupid idea, but I did it. Um, and now it's left me in a bit of a hole where I'm paying off all this finance. And I work in the restaurant industry as well, where this closing at 10 o'clock. As much as people say it's helpful and all that, it is destroying business. So this video is me saying that I'm actually going to start up an eBay account. And I am, will have the link in down below. Uh, I will be selling some of the most valuable cards from my set. And this is just kind of a show off and go, these are the cards I have and these are what we're going to have. So we're going to look here. I've got this pack of top loaders. Um, all with these cards in. So let's have a look what we got. We've got my Shiny Legends Eevee. The Evolutions Charizard. Oh, that's a bit of tape. The card is in perfect condition. A Hitmonchan from base set 2. A Machamp from base set 2. A little bit beaten up in the corners, but not too bad at all. A Dark Machamp from the Rocket set. That's the non holo version. Rocket Sneak Attack. That is the holographic version, number 16. Dark Alakazam. Yet again, it's the non holographic version. A Gold Scoop Up Net. Cinderance V that is not the promo that is from Rebel Clash number 178 Arcanine from the Detective Pikachu the artwork on that is absolutely lovely uh, and then we've got a couple of random cards from Booster Packs and that have opened you've got Lorantis GX Turtonator GX if they're coming to focus there we go we have Incineroar GX. That's not the great one from that set, unfortunately. We've got Alolan Golem. Yeah, again, that's just on the top loader. Um, there you go, there's the good Incineroar. And GX again. So obviously these will all be promo right here. Just a Tapu Coco. Very prices. Machamp EX. That's a promo, that's a promo Machamp. Wigglytuff GX, an old school speed stadium, uh, Jesse and James, that is a holographic, not reverse, just a normal, uh, Olivia Full Up, Lycan Rock GX, I'm going to butcher this, but Nihil Go GX. Uvatile GX, Sceptile GX, Japanese Neuvern Full Art GX, Beedrill EX, Flareon EX, and this is the crown and jewel of this whole collection. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to sell this one to make myself at least a little bit of money. Holographic Dark Charizard. From Rocket. That is number four. One moment, I'm going to get a sleeve and we'll see what it's like. Right, so I've removed it from the top loader. You can see there, I've got a glint on that foil. That's number four. Completely real. A few little nicks at the top, and like literally nothing to write home about. What a wonderful, wonderful card. It'll be a shame to lose it. Uh, there will be other cards, obviously, going up. But that was the majority of my Pokemon collection, the ones that I really wanted to sell. If I really needed to, I do have a back of this folder. 
I have not run complete Team Rocket set. I could sell most of that, hence where all the Rocket cards have come from. Um, and I'll be giving, sorry, get a price point on these uh, Dragon Ball Super Cards. Um, they're really nice, colourful, lovely, gorgeous cards, but I don't really know what to do with them. They just kind of sit in this folder and. Well, that's it. These are some Final Fantasy ones that I just bought for the sake of it. Back when I had the time and money. Uh, so yeah, that's really it. And the other thing I'm going to say is I am probably going to have time to start steering away from Pokemon a bit. Maybe I'll get a few bits here or there. But as far as hobbies go, Pokemon is probably the most expensive. I'm an avid Magic the Gathering player as well. And booster pack prices for um, Magic the Gathering pack is two pound for fifteen cards, or you can get special deals. Yeah, they're really about the same amount of sets as Pokemon, but I just prefer the game to be completely honest, and I, I think it's great. Um, like I say, I still buy Pokemon packs every now and then. But what will probably happen is if I pull a GX and EX or a really good card, I will just put it on my eBay account. So to summarize, I am back. Yes, I am back. I will be doing pack openings. Probably once every other week to start until I get a bit more back in the swing and get a bit of revenue coming in. Um, I'm starting an eBay account. It'll be in the link below. And I'm probably moving slightly away from Pokemon cards, unfortunately. Maybe a few Yu-Gi-Oh cards as well. Uh, the reason I'm not saying any of these is these are all fake as hell. Uh, so that's really it. Thank you very much for taking some time to watch in this video, hearing me out and this hearing uh, and if this won't be going on my ebay account it will be on my insta account at the collector's cave anyone would like a chance to try and buy this i have not touched it my friend sold it to me and i have probably gonna get rid of it uh, a neo genesis sec not complete not by far not. Hang on, we'll just zoom the camera out a bit by far it is not complete but it is probably all commons and uncommons. Maybe you're missing a few commons, but nothing really to shout home about. Like you're missing the Blastoise that goes there, and something that goes there. You know, you're missing Agron. You get S Cavalier, but you haven't got the down the little version. We have Shelmets at the front. You've got the Machamp, but you haven't got the other Machamp. Haven't got Houndoom. So yeah, it's not 100% complete. Not by any stretch of the imagination. But it goes all the way up to 94, and he's probably got about 80 cards out of the 94 in there. Um, and any of these other sets I have probably will be going up for sale at a later date. I don't want to, like I say. But I think I might have to. But once again, thank you very much for taking the time to listen to me. I appreciate it dearly, and I shall catch you in the next video.